Hey guys, I am going to walk you through how to create an image and a text link using your affiliate links found in CJ. We are going to create a post that includes this cross back tank and bloomer set for baby that I found at Old Baby. So the first thing I do when I want to create a post is I just go ahead and save the image directly off of the Old Navy website to my desktop. I prefer to upload images directly to my site versus using the text link or the image link that I can get from CJ um, in the affiliate portion. Um, and the reason is because an image link that's provided by Old Navy Will eventually expire. Once Old Navy is no longer selling this product, they will purge it from their affiliate interface. The problem with that for me as a blogger is that I don't want that item to suddenly disappear from my site. I may not want people to buy it anymore, so I would need to go back and update the post perhaps. But if I'm using this image link on my site, and CJ deletes it, then my site, my uh, blog post is going to have a big empty box in it where this image once was. So for that reason, I save all images and upload them directly to my site to prevent that from happening. So once we have the image saved, we are going to take note of the name. Here we're going to use Bloomer Set for Baby to go to CJ to search for this item. So we want to click over to CJ and we are going to go to links search, which is what we're on now. And then right here, you're going to have the option of looking for a link. And this is ideal if you're looking for a specific text link. But in this case, we are looking for a product. So we're going to search, uh, switch that to products there. We're going to type in the advertiser who is Old Navy. And the keyword we're just going to use uh, bloomer set for baby to see what gets pulled up here. So you see here it's automatically checked. I highly recommend um, only searching your advertisers. Otherwise you are going to get products that are all across CJ and may have nothing to do with what you want to write about. And it won't matter because if you're not in their program you can't promote them anyhow. So always make sure that button is clicked. Now, as you see here, Old Navy is selling a lot of baby bloomer sets right now, but we can see this is the one that we were just looking at. So if you click on it, you'll see a lot of different information comes up here that Old Navy is sharing with you. Uh, free shipping on $50, the sizing that's available, condition is obviously new, a description, all of that good stuff. I normally ignore that for the most part. I don't need it for my posts. So what you want to do though is you either want to click on get code that's right here or you can click on these little brackets. So when you click on get code a bunch of other information shows up here. Website you can choose which website you are going to be posting this information to. You can um, there are different things here, but I don't use them. You can hide your tracking link. You can set the link to open in a new browser, and you can encrypt the link. These basically pertain to if you're using HTML code, which I don't use. Uh, but I will show you what HTML code is. So you can go here, and obviously these are all of your link options. Uh, if you want to use HTML code, all you need to do is grab it right there. So that's the image code. Go to your post, and normally it starts on visual. You're going to want to change it to text, and then just paste in that code. And if you go back to visual, you see just like that, there is your uh, baby bloomer set, the, uh, the image of it. You can go right back to CJ and you can also grab the text link, copy that, paste that again in the text editor, paste that in, and then when you go back 
to the visual editor, you'll see you have the image and you have a really awkward line of text um, that this is all of the information Old Navy would like you to include. Generally, people don't talk like this. It would be really awkward if you had a blog post full of links that looked like this. Um, so there were, that's one reason that I don't use HTML links. Um, they're just long and cumbersome. Personally, I prefer to use click URLs. Basically, all this is is the direct link to the item you want to write about with your affiliate link attached. So all you have to do is copy that. If we go back to our post, you can even do it in the visual editor. Add your media, so that's going to be the bloomer. I already uploaded it here that, um, that we want to add to the post. Uh, you have your title. You want to have more creative alt text than that, probably a better title too. But one thing you want to do here when you're uploading the photo is in Attachment Display Settings, make sure you add your affiliate link here. This will make it so that your romper photo, your bloomers, whatever they are, is a clickable image. Okay, That is key because some people really like using clickable images. Um, some of your readers will prefer to click on that image than they will to find the actual link that you're also going to put in your post. Some people are visual shoppers and that's great. So being able to link directly to your affiliate link makes that easy. So we're going to go ahead and insert that into the post and obviously there are our boomers. Um, and then we want to, what is this called again? The cross back take and boomer set for baby. If we want to add a text link, then all we would do is type out our text, add our link, and again, this is the affiliate link, and save it. So now we have a, we have an image, we have a text link. I'm gonna go ahead and save that so we can preview. The one big thing you want to do um, before you ever publish a post is I always recommend previewing it to make sure that the links work. So we're going to go ahead and click preview here. The post will open up and you can see There we go. We have our image here and the text link is here. The image, go ahead and click on that and you'll see that it goes right to the Old Navy web page and it is working. So that is a very quick way to add CJ links to your blog. This method works for any affiliate that works with CJ, any advertiser that works with CJ, you will be able to pull links in exactly the same way.